So due to the recent events that have been going on in the market uh, with COPS, with Mirafi, with Swepnex, I think is the other one, and many others that are actually to come, I decided to make this video where I want to talk about the crypto scams that are actually surrounding us and the risks in this industry, okay? These are just my thoughts. These are just my recommendations, what I actually think. This is not financial advice. And more importantly, I'm not defending any anyone whatsoever inside of a company. I think that anyone who actually scams someone needs to be in jail. Obviously, that's not going to happen to the majority of them. But I just want to clarify that I'm not defending anyone. I'm not the owner of any company. And if anything, I'm the owner of BLW brand. And you guys know all my BLW products. You can go to blwonlinetrading.com and learn what it's mine, but this is in regards to crypto scam. So let's go ahead and dive right, uh, dive right into it. If you guys are new to my channel and uh, you guys wanna learn a little bit more in regards to cryptocurrencies, uh, trading Forex and every, every type of making money online, then this is an opportunity for you. Let's go ahead and dive right into uh, this YouTube channel. Every single day, I'll be making moves till I'm buried in my grave. To the system, I don't want to be a slave. I've been doing shit. My First of all, what are cryptocurrencies? For those of you who are very new in my channel, just gonna take about 30 seconds to explain you. Cryptocurrencies are digital currencies that are created on a daily basis where that you can use online in order to exchange for different type of assets such as uh, bitcoin ethereum litecoin uh, xrp luna terra and all those uh, that are pretty famous uh, during the last few days so basically you can use any of those currencies to exchange for different stuff a lot of people are accepting bitcoin or cryptocurrencies in order to purchase stuff online and so on that's a cryptocurrency is a decentralized exchange it, they work as a decentralized centralized exchange so you don't have to go to the bank or anything everything is handled online so with this racing of cryptocurrencies there's a lot of people thinking hey that's where the money is and that's true but they actually think that the money is out there easy just by you know i want to learn what bitcoin is and people actually tell me this all the time like hey you know what chris i want to make money like you do so can you tell me how you do it and then i'm gonna do it it's not like that it's not like anybody can just jump in here i can tell you a tip or two and they're just gonna become rich that's not the way it is but you know that's what people think. So there's many, way of, many ways of making money with cryptocurrencies. The first one is actually crypto trading. Crypto trading is like the most common one, but this is made through Forex trading. Okay. Some people are like, okay, so what is the best crypto trading broker? It's not crypto trading broker. It's a Forex broker that allows you to trade with cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin. Those are the most common ones, but some other brokers allow you to trade with Dogecoin with, uh, and so on. Okay. Solana. So crypto trading, basically it's exactly like Forex. I don't want to get that deep into it, but it's exactly like Forex. You got a stop loss, you got to take profit, you got an enterprise, you got, you got spreads. All of that is actually part of the crypto trading, bottom line. Second way of making money with it is through crypto investing slash holding. So this means right now, Bitcoin is at $29,000. You can buy Bitcoin right now, whatever amount you want to. You don't necessarily have to buy an entire Bitcoin, but you can buy, I don't know, uh, $10,000 in Bitcoin or $15,000 in Bitcoin, whatever you want to. And then uh, expect the price to actually start going up and make some profit out of it. You can hold the money that you already have. You don't have to buy new Bitcoin every day. If you already have an amount, like for instance, myself, I have a certain amount of Bitcoins. So I just hold them and expect the price to actually go up. Okay. That's the other way. Now, Obviously, this way is a lot more conservative. It's got its own risks, but it's super conservative. So you don't have those emotions involved unless you invest more than you can afford to lose, right? The third way is actually crypto softwares. And this is where the scams actually come and take place. Bitcoin itself is not a scam. Forex itself is not a scam. But there are some crypto softwares that are a scam or not a scam per se, but they end up being a scam at the end of the days. Uh, crypto softwares, there are crypto robots, 
Uh, I saw a KuCoin robot as well that works for cryptocurrencies. Uh, you can also see crypto arbitrage systems. You can see yield farming. So I'm not saying these types of making money are scams. I'm just saying softwares use these models as scams. Okay, just, just want to get, I mean, you got to understand what I'm saying, right? I'm not accusing anyone or anything like that. So those are like ways of making scams. Now let's go ahead and talk about the common scams that are out there. Number one is fake people on social media. For instance, in the comment section, there are there's a lot of fake profiles on Instagram telling me, hey, I'll telling people, hey, I'm Christian AP with all my pictures and so on, and asking you to send them Bitcoin and they'll just go ahead and multiply that income. That's a scam. Telegram, Facebook, anywhere. So there are crypto traders or crypto investors that are just gonna triple your money within a day. It's impossible. It's impossible to do that. Okay, so those are uh, one type of scam. Another type of scam is when you actually invest in someone that you already know and they just run away with your money, which is pretty much the same, but without they faking my face, okay, without they pretending to be me. Then we jump into the Ponzi schemes. Ponzi schemes are basically uh, multi level marketing type of companies you know, that where we got one leader, that leader starts uh, getting two people to promote the products and then those two getting two more and two more and two more. And then they build like a thousand people network. But then what happens? What happens is that whenever there's new, there's no new people coming in, there's no way to pay people, you know, of the uplines. So what happens there is that the network starts to disappear and eventually it crashes. So who makes money with the Ponzi scheme? The people that join first. Is it a scam per se? It's not a scam. It's a Ponzi scheme. Okay. A lot of people hate it. And I know some people who are actually into multi-level marketing and they make tons of money when they join because they join at the beginning. It's not ethical. It's not something I personally join, but it is what it is. I'm just telling you what the, the type of the things are. Okay. Now, what is the risk and risks and all methods? And this is something that you got to keep in mind. Okay. I don't want to extend that much into this because I mentioned this in pretty much every single video. You need to involve, invest only what you can afford to lose. A lot of people made a huge mistake with cops by putting all of their hard earned money. Some people mortgaged their houses. Some people sold their cars to put the money in, asked money to the bank and they lost it all. Okay. What is it that I always tell you when you ask me for advice? Invest only what you can afford to lose. That's number one. Number two is get education. Okay. So what is the risks? The risks is that we are in an online world. Okay. We don't have a physical office right there for cops. We don't have a physical office right there for Binance, at least not in my location. We don't have a physical, everything is online. So what do you think could happen from one day to the other? Pretty much you could just lose. I mean, the website can go down and that's pretty much it. You lose everything. The website stop existing. The creators just run away with your money. That's one of the risks. So what are my recommendations? Make money as soon as you can. If you join a software such as cops, for instance, a lot of people make money, not me, but a lot of people make money. Why? Because they took advantage while the system was alive. So this is the method that I use. I put a thousand dollars in or whatever amount I want to put in. I make that money in profit and then I withdraw my initial deposit. That way I'm risk free. So everything that comes along is going to be pure profit. And if I don't make any profit because the website goes down, that's fine. I didn't lose any money. That's the way I do it. That's the reason why I'm jumping right now into a bunch of different systems or different uh, softwares. And I'm going to keep on recommending what I personally use. And you can do that as well. You can use that as well. But only, only invest what you can afford to lose. Okay. So if I invest, because I'm going to share within the next couple of days, a couple of other systems that I found, because I really find them interesting. Uh, I invest the money into it. I'm trying them literally with my own money so that then we can go ahead and share it in the YouTube channel. And then once I share it, you get to decide whether you want to join or not, but join only with money that you can afford to lose. Hopefully we can all make money. If not, then I'm just going to move to the next one, to the next one. A lot of people said, hey, this is hurting your brand. My brand is this. 
telling you things clear. Your choice is whether you go with it or not. You don't have to, okay? So I'm just diversifying my income. If you guys wanna be part of it, I'm gonna be sharing. Invest only what you can afford to lose. And once you make that money, withdraw it and leave only the profit so that you are risk-free. So hopefully this video helps you guys out like to be safe on this crypto space because I'm gonna keep on making videos in regards to it, but I wanted to make sure that I explained this to you. So hopefully this video helps you. And if it did, make sure you smash the like button, leave the comments, leave any comment or questions you guys have in the comment section below and be subscribed for more videos just like this one. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one.